Blackwell, Oklahoma. Blackwell is a city in Kay County, Oklahoma, United States, located at the intersection of U.S. Highway 177 and State Highway 11 along Interstate 35. The population was 7,092 at the 2010 census. Blackwell was established following the September 16, 1893 Cherokee Outlet land run by A.J. Blackwell. Blackwell has an agricultural and fossil fuel-based economy. Blackwell came into existence during the Cherokee Outlet opening on September 16, 1893 in the run known as the Cherokee Strip Land Run. The town is named for A.J. Blackwell, who was the dominant force in its founding. A post office was established on December 1, 1893. Due to a struggle for regional prominence between Blackwell and nearby Parker, the post office was named Parker from April 2, 1894, to February 4, 1895. After the latter date, the name reverted to Blackwell. Andrew Blackwell had settled in the area in 1882, having married the former Rosa Vaught who was of Cherokee descent. He was eligible to found the city. Blackwell served as Justice of the Peace and Mayor of Blackwell. Blackwell's first school opened in September 1893 in a small, frame building with 52 students in attendance. A gradual enrollment increase created a need for 10 teachers by 1899. Prior to the Civil Rights Movement, Blackwell had a reputation as a sundown town, having kept out African Americans through violent expulsion and the display off a sign warning them to leave town by sunset. Blackwell's expulsion of its African-American residents around 1893 is described in the 1967 book From Slavery to Freedom by John Hope Franklin. The Blackwell Zinc Company smelter first began operations in 1917. In 1974, the 80-acre Blackwell Zinc smelter facility ceased operations. At the time, it was the city's largest employer, employing 800 people in 1972, and over 1,000 at its peak. It also was one of the largest zinc smelter facilities in the United States. After its closure the land and was donated to the Blackwell Industrial Authority, BIA. Soil from the land was repurposed throughout the city, leading to widespread contamination of air and water, including the Chickaskia River. Additionally, one of the plant's two Corliss stationary steam engines was moved to Pawnee, Oklahoma and preserved. This engine is run for viewing by the public on the first weekend of May. The Oklahoma Department of Environmental Quality has been overseeing remediation of contamination at the industrial park, groundwater, and soil throughout parts of the city since 1992. Phelps Dodge Corporation, a subsidiary of Freeport McMoran Copper and Gold Incorporated, has owned the site since 1999. On October 15, 2009, the city of Blackwell filed suit against Freeport McMoran, calling the contamination a nuisance and alleging that 58 million pounds of toxic waste remained in the city, causing illness within its 7,200 residents. Following several changes of venue between federal court and Kay County courts, the city of Blackwell and Freeport settled for $54 million on February 4, 2010. Blackwell was a victim of the 1955 Great Plains tornado outbreak, a deadly tornado outbreak that struck the southern and central U.S. Great Plains states on May 25 to 26, 1955. It produced at least 46 tornadoes across seven states including two F-5 tornadoes in Blackwell, Oklahoma, and Udall, Kansas. The outbreak killed 102 from three tornadoes while injuring hundreds more. Unusual electromagnetic activity was observed, including St. Elmo's fire. The Blackwell tornado formed in Noble County at around 9 p.m. CDT before crossing through the eastern portions of the K County town of Blackwell Os on F5 Wedge Tornado. Then about wide, Grassley's 1991, it claimed the lives of 20 people in Blackwell and injured over 200 before crossing into and dissipating over Cowley County, Kansas. Along with destroying nearly 200 homes, the tornado demolished two of the town's main employers, the Acme Foundry and the Hazel Atlas Glass Plant. 400 homes were destroyed or swept away, and 500 other homes were damaged. 60 businesses were also destroyed and the local hospital sustained major damage. Most of the western half of the town was spared the worst of the damage. Blackwell is located at 36.801764. Minus 97.289856, along the Chickaskia River and to the east of Interstate 35. According to the United States Census Bureau, the city has a total area of, of which, of it is land and 0.18% is water. In May 1906, an L5 meteorite fell, landing in Blackwell, Oklahoma. On May 25, 1955, a deadly F5 tornado, 
part of the 1955 Great Plains tornado outbreak, struck Blackwell at approximately 9.30 p.m. and cut a swath of destruction through the northeastern portion of the city, roughly centered in the neighborhoods surrounding Riverside Park. Twenty residents died and 250 were injured. The tornado outbreak included another F5 tornado that struck Hudal, Kansas killing 82 people and injuring 270. The outbreak spawned 19 tornadoes across Oklahoma, Texas and Kansas alone. Blackwell Public Schools has four schools, including an early childhood center, an elementary school, a middle school and a high school. For the 2011-2012 school year, there were approximately 1,500 students enrolled. As of the census of 2000, there were 7,668 people, 3,064 households, and 2,086 families residing in the city. The population density was 1,407.3 people per square mile, 543.2 per square kilometer. There were 3,527 housing units at an average density of 647.3 per square mile, 249.9 per square kilometer. The racial makeup of the city was 87.26% white, 4.13% Native American, 0.47% Asian, 0.13% African American, 0.01% Pacific Islander, 3.17% from other races, and 4.83% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 5.91% of the population. There were 3,064 households out of which 32.1% had children under the age of 18 living with him, 54.1% were married couples living together, 9.9% had a female householder with no husband present, and 31.9% were non-families. 28.8% of all households were made up of individuals and 15.1% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.46 and the average family size was 3.01. In the city, the population was spread out with 27.0% under the age of 18, 9.0% from 18 to 24, 23.9% from 25 to 44, 21.5% from 45 to 64, and 18.6% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 38 years. For every 100 females, there were 92.1 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 88.7 males. The median income for a household in the city was $25,835, and the median income for a family was $31,540. Males had a median income of $25,202 versus $16,704 for females. The per capita income for the city was $13,558. About 13.1% of families and 17.1% of the population were below the poverty line, including 22.4% of those under age 18 and 10.4% of those age 65 or over. The top of Oklahoma Historical Society Museum is located in the Electric Park Pavilion and displays artifacts from the land run, antiques, and local history. Blackwell hosts the Kay County Free Fair in September. Blackwell is served by five major parks including Riverside, Bagby, Rogers, Memorial, and Legion Parks. Blackwell has one major and two minor public pools. Blackwell is also home to a brick WPA armory which is listed on the National Register of Historic Places. Blackwell is a home rule charter city, which is governed by council city manager form of government. The current city manager is Thomas Chiphuthier. The city council consists of Steve Marquardt, Tom Belial, John Webb, and Richard Braden, with mayor's position currently held by T.J. Greenfield. The chief of police is Dwayne Wood and the fire chief is Dirk Seabridge. The Blackwell School District consists of Blackwell Middle School and Blackwell High School, as well as Houston, Northside, Parkside, and Washington Elementary Schools, which are all listed on the National Register of Historic Places. The school mascot in the Maroons historically, Oklahoma Baptist College served the city's higher education needs between 1901 and 1913. Blackwell's local paper is the Blackwell Journal Tribune, radio station KOKB 1580 AM broadcast sports. Blackwell has a full-service city government, that includes, electricity, sewage and police and fire services. The police department has 17 full-time officers, a jail and operates 24 hours per day. 
The Blackwell Fire Department is a full-time fire department, staffed with 20 paid firefighters EMT slash paramedics and also provides ambulance service to Blackwell and the surrounding communities. Blackwell's drinking water is the color orange and has been deemed undrinkable. Blackwell is home to the Blackwell Tonkawa Municipal Airport with neighboring Tonkawa, Oklahoma. Historically, Blackwell was home to the Blackwell, Enid, and Southwestern Railway. Blackwell and the surrounding communities are served by the city-owned Blackwell Regional Hospital, a 53-bed facility with 24-hour emergency services and helipad. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.